Welcome to the Critic Court, the YouTube experience where we're answering and asking the question, should you watch a particular TV show or movie? Now, today on the course document, we have the film American Fiction, all right? Now, let's get into the cast of American Fiction. Talk to us about the star-studded cast for this movie. Well, I, you guys, I am excited about this. We have the cast members, Jeffrey Wright, who I love. Y'all remember he's in so much uh, different films. We got Tracy Ellis Ross, we got Erica Alexander, who played Maxine from Living Single, we got Issa Rae, we got Sterling K. Brown, we got all these fantastic actors and actresses. All right, now with all that being said, based on the trailer, does this trailer move you to want to see this film? It did, I am, uh, I am a fan of satire. Now this is kind of like high brand. So, it, you know, this may come a little bit, you know, this ain't for people who... Okay, so let me get into that because we need to talk yeah. about the plot because this plot gonna do a lot that's gonna yeah. make people. So, first of all, we're talking about a novelist. Now, for you folks that out there that ain't well versed, yeah. a novelist is a person who writes a novel and a novel is a book. Like, Back in the day before YouTube, people used to do something called reading and it was an actual book and there were words in the book and your brain had to interpret what the words said and it communicate. Now, I know that you have heard a thing called book but you have heard of audio book. Yeah. Well, that is not, that was an actual version of a book and it had words in it and you read it between your mind and the words that were on the piece of paper. But we're on past those Very days. Archaic. Anyway, yeah. an novelist who's fed up with the establishment profiting from black entertainment, he uses a pen name. Now let's talk about pen name because I know you Yeah, you don't know it's not. fine. All right. So a pen name is a fake name. Uh, I will say a nickname, if you will. Yeah, a good. nickname for the author so he does not actually use his real name so people don't know that he actually wrote it. So he uses a fake name, aka a nickname, to get this work out without being associated with him. He uses a pen name to write a book that propels him to the heart of hypocrisy and the madness he claims to disdain. Okay, so again, as you refer to Explain this, hypocrisy. This, this, okay, hypocrisy. Yep, say, one, say, yep. say one thing, do something else. Don't okay, say, say one thing, do something else. Okay. okay, so now with this project, okay, if you are of a certain intellect, I believe that you're going to find this to be very interesting. Yes. Love the cast. Yes. I think that they did a great job, Fantastic. not just giving us a whole bunch of all stars, but putting a bunch of putting the all stars in position where it can actually be a team effort. Yeah. Okay, there's been movies where they just given us a whole bunch of stars. They feel out place. They feel like they're competing for the screen time. But this in the trailer does not feel like that. All right, this feels like. They were strategically cast. They're going to come in and bring what they usually bring. And it's going to help create a great experience for this project. Again, I'm going to preface this by saying, this is for people of a particular intellect. Okay. This one, in, this, one. this one involves you being able to understand story and being able to understand story structure. Yeah. You being able to sit through a movie without touching your phone uh, to see what's going watch. on. Okay. you got This is one you got to watch. So now with that being said, we got to have a conversation. Because those who understand this film, I believe, will like it. Yep. Those who are not as versed into this subject area, I believe that they're going to miss. Which means when we're talking about the overall domestic sales of this project, we can't get into a numbers game with this one. Because this is not going to be blockbuster numbers, both in terms of people who went and watched it and in terms of money that it made. So we can't judge this one based on that because it's, it's highbrow intellect. And you know that's hard for us. You just gotta but, keep this one close to that's, it. It's hard for us, you know what I'm saying, nowadays, because people are getting. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? People, I, I ain't saying, but you, you know what I mean when I'm saying people are getting. You know what I'm saying? A lot of books a million closer. You know what I'm saying? A lot, a lot, a lot of bars and noble ain't noble and no more. Yeah. And, and, and we understand, you know what I'm saying? But YouTube up though. You know what I'm saying? YouTube is up. And uh, thank y'all for coming on, on YouTube. That's that what we here for. So you ain't got to worry about reading. Read. Nobody read no more. We YouTube that. So, uh, so again, if you are of a certain intellect, I believe you're gonna like this. Movie. All right, man. If you this ain't for you, if you, it's gonna go live. we'll have another video for you. Yeah. Right. So even with this, yeah. don't think that this video is gonna be representative of what this channel can do. Cause Take, keep watching. you Take probably watch. you probably ain't click on it if you you know what I'm saying if you wasn't good at some kind of reading. You like that poster? It, yeah, you, you know what? Cause first of all, we gotta talk about fiction. fiction. Yeah, fiction. American fiction. Fiction means fake. I know it's been a while since some of y'all was in English school. One? You was in school and you. 
you know what I'm saying? You, you, you might not be paying that much attention to said teacher. No. You know, him, her, they, no. whichever he, pronoun. He, they he might be. Okay, so uh, with that being said, this is fake, okay? This is a satire. Yeah, satire is okay? uh -huh. the Satire means, okay, uh, it's in the vein of hypocrisy. They're going to say things and do things, but it is for comedic and drama value. Yes. Okay, so again, yes. we preface in all this just, just to say, we know that this film ain't for everybody. Yes. Now, let's talk about our zero to five gavel rating for this film. On a scale of zero being, you ain't interested in this at all, five being you're super excited about this project, how many gavel slams do you give the film American Fiction? Uh, for me, based on, you know, the critics out there of the world, giving this a 96% on the audience score, as well as my love for of the cast alone, I'm gonna go ahead and give this a two and a half. Yeah, because I I agree with you. Now, this is not for everybody. If you're not into highbrow fiction, you don't know a thing about satire. I just move on. Just just scroll on. However, though. I, I believe this will do something for you. Uh, these are some great actors and actresses in this. I love the trailer alone. And so for me, I'm going to go ahead and give it to it. All right. Now, uh, I, I'm going to halfway agree with you, okay? I'm not going to go as high as two and a half slams, but I am going to surprise you and I'm going to do this. I'm going to give it two slams, okay? Well, that's we pretty close, you know what I'm saying? For us, that's pretty good. That's okay. Good, and I'm going two slams on this one. The reason yeah, why so I, I couldn't get an extra half a slam is because I don't know if this gonna come out in all movie theaters. It's nice. It's, it's, it's in selected the theaters. Theater. Okay, that, that's what I read. So I wasn't sure if they was gonna roll this out. That lets you know, you know. So that that's letting you know they're gonna hit certain markets. So they already understand this from a dollar standpoint. It's not gonna do what you would think some of the big blockbuster films would do. It's it's not gonna do that. But I do believe, again, those in this particular genre and in this particular niche that like these type of films, I believe that we're going to enjoy this one. Okay, it is one where you got to sit back, you got to put your phone down, you're going to have to watch and understand the story. Now, with the plot being the way how it is, I believe that they're doing this on purpose to send a message that you have to make particular content in order to get certain people's attention. Mm. Now, with that being said, you must ask, are they preaching to the choir? The people who will watch this are these people who are already aware of this message. Did this get to the sexy red listeners? I don't think it's going to, okay? Have, well, okay, well, well, cause, cause I had to give a metaphor to let you know that there's, there's a difference in the interpretation of sexy red music and who listening to this. Sexy red fans, y'all scroll on. But they ain't in this. Then you ain't talking to them. They ain't in this. They're not. They ain't in this. If they ski in, they not on this. They didn't click on this. Okay, so they ski right on. They didn't. They zoom right on past. So they ain't in it. What I'm saying is, I'm trying to give a metaphor <laughs> to say that there's there's levels. There is. There are the ski heels. Yeah, and this not. And then there's the ski wheels. The AKs uh, and the groups okay, and the I'm gonna, say, black. Gonna fix it. I'm gonna fix okay. it. Let me help you out. I'm gonna do that. Let me get to you one more okay, time. Okay, not the. There's the ski eagles, six of red milk. Uh -huh. And then there's the ski wheels. <laughs> that is the ski wheels. This is the African American educated populace. There's a huge gap, and that gap is wide. Okay, and so those of us who you educated and on that upper brow. Uh, who have visited a books a million, who are familiar with Barnes and Noble. A literature. Uh, you're familiar with literature and uh, something I think the Greeks used to call a library. Um, if you're familiar with those things, then this film is going to deliver for you. If you are ski yell and you, that, that what you listen to all day, every day, this is not the project for you. Although don't, I do love a little ski. <laughs> see, that's the problem. See, that's what, that's what this film yeah, touches. No, don't get this that's, that's what this film touches. It's called balance. No, no, no. It ain't, it ain't called that. Sex Red Hanger. No, she's not going to watch this. She, no, she's not, she's not going to watch this. And, and I, I prefer Congrats she's not. Congrats on the baby. Well, that's okay. Yeah, you're going to make me look a certain way. So now I got to say it. I don't know where he Congrats on the baby. However, I am educated. Yeah, uh, again, I ain't saying that we can't, we can't live in duality. We can't. We can't. I'm just saying we when we talk about this film, I'm saying, <laughs> Ski Wee. Ski Yee. It sounds the same, but it's way it's different. different. It's way it's different. different. It's okay, different. that's that gap. Okay. So, if you will. Okay, so now, 
We got to watch this project, okay? Uh -huh. Now, I know, I, I think there's rumors that it's going to be coming to HBO Max. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm not yeah. sure yeah. if it's going to be in a theater around where we at. This is a particular project that I want to see. I that I want to come back and do a review on this. Because yeah. I want to see if our initial trailer reaction is going to match what we actually thought the film was going to deliver. Now it's time for us to hear from you, okay? okay? Do you think that this is a project that you should watch, okay? Based on the trailer, how are you feeling about this? Now, we, she was a two and a half gal now. I was at a two, okay? Because I don't think that this is going to reach who they wanted it to, but I believe that it's going to deliver for those of who us who wanted it to, to be delivered to. Yes. Okay, Amazon Prime, it'll get there on time. All right, so now, y'all let us know down in the comment section how you think. And again, we appreciate we appreciate y'all watching this. You, you made it this far in the video. Thank you for your time. Uh, it's very much appreciated. And if you can do us a favor, do hit that thumbs up button. Yeah, uh, hit that button and say subscribe. Hit that Go down there in the comments uh, and then hit that. Uh, we're doing this weekly. Something. Okay, we're doing this weekly. weekly. This is what she said. Weekly. Uh, so we just going to we, we keep going. Away. We got other videos. We, go ahead, go ahead and watch them. Uh, One to the left. Is it going to be on the left? 